You give you one of these, ma'am? Sure. You know that they murder babies just right around the corner from here? Yeah. So what does your Christianity look like in a culture that murders babies, not only murders baby, but right around the corner? It's, it's sinful. It really is. I'm all for pro-life. Right, ma'am, but what does that look like? What do you mean? What does that look like? I mean, pro-life is a good moral opinion. Amen. Lots of people have a good moral opinion. Right. But does God's word say that we're supposed to have a good moral opinion? Or we're supposed to do something? We're supposed to stop it. So what do, what does that look like? I'm not getting what is your what we need to get a group of people and and stop all these abortions. There right, ma'am. Something about it. That's why we're here because you're a church that li that's living in peace with child sacrifice. Literally, right? I mean, I stood out there yesterday, okay? I'm a traveling minister. They stand out here. She stands out here with other people every week. They're the only people stand out here except for the Catholics. Innocent children are being murdered. This is the third leading child killing state in the country behind New York and California. And that's not something to be a proud thing of. And the place is surrounded by churches. What church do you go to? I'm a pastor of a home church in Texas. Okay? But we are here to open people's eyes. I mean, what are we doing? What are we doing? Did Jesus say that we're supposed to just have good moral opinion? God's word says that we're supposed to defend those that are being taken to the slaughter, to practice pure and undefiled religion.